Hello, this is Laptop Media, and today, we will show you how to open the Acer Swift 5 Pro SF514 55 GT and what's inside of it. To get inside, you need to undo 11 Torx head screws. After that, pry the bottom panel with a plastic tool and you're done. Please remember, it would be of great help to us if you just hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would motivate us to make even more and better videos for you. Ultimately, there is no difference in the layout, nor the cooling, when compared to the last year's Swift 5 Pro. Two heat pipes are taking the heat away from the two chips, and leading it to the heat spreader. Then, an average-sized fan blows it away from the backside of the chassis. Sadly, the memory is soldered to the motherboard, so you are left with the 8GB or the 16GB of LPDDR4X you purchased the device with. On the bright side, you can swap the M.2 SSD with a faster or a larger one. Our unit has a 56Wh battery pack. Interestingly, it is mounted to the chassis via double-sided tape, so if you have to remove it, make sure you have some tape at your disposal. If you'd like to see more disassembly videos of the latest notebooks we would highly appreciate if you hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.